Hey guys, I was uh, just playing around with the new X-Tool RA2 rotary that I've got here on my Atom Stack S20 Pro. And I was just curious, I just finished doing a little carve here on this dowel. This is one inch dowel, and I was just curious if it would actually cut all the way through it. Now, there's the one inch. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go do a uh, line in light burn. And we're going to see if we can make it through uh, this dowel uh, in one pass. I'm just curious. That means it would have to cut a half inch. And obviously make one full rotation for it to cut through it. So let's go see if that will happen. Head into the house. Okay, so we're here in light burn. And I think all I'm going to do is uh, just, I'm just going to draw a line. And to get the length of it, I'm just going to go up here to the rotary. We're going to put in one inch. That's going to give us our circumference, which is 3.14159. just happens to be pi. I'm going to copy that. Everything else looks good there. I'm going to come up here. I'm going to select the line. Come up here to the link. Paste in what we had. And there we go. So we've got one line. That is 3 inches, 141 thousandths long. I've got the rotary enabled. I've got my job origin set at the top. As you can see by the little green dot right here. So what that should do is whenever I send this file to the rotary, it's going to make one revolution. And by the time it gets all the way around, we'll see if it actually cut all the way through it. Now let's go ahead and set our stuff up here. Uh, okay, it's already set to line mode. Number of passes is one. Uh, I'm going to leave it set. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave it set at 100% power. And we're going to go ahead and leave it set. Yeah, we'll leave it set at 100. You know what? I'm going to speed it up. I'm going to go ahead and go 200. We're going to hit OK to that. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go up here to File. We're going to go to Save G Code. There's Light Burn. Uh, that's not where I'll go down here to Adam Stack. We'll go to G Code. I'm going to create a new folder. We'll call it Dowel. And for the file name, I'm just going to call it One Inch Cut 200 Millimeters 100 power. Hit save. Uh, come over here to my Atom Stack web UI. Go over here to SD file. We don't have anything on the laser right now. Right here's our dowel folder that we just made. There's our file. We've just sent it to the laser. So let's go see what this thing will do. Hey there dog. S20 Pro carve. There's our file. I'm going to hit position. I'm going to hit yes. I'm going to hit go.
actually, you can see right there, it just, it didn't quite get that last little bit. It needed to go, it needed to rotate just, just a couple more degrees and it would have went ahead and cut all the way through it. But it actually made it all the way through the center. kind of see a little better right there on the end. Yeah, I should have just let it overshoot just a couple of degrees. And then uh, that probably would have been a little better test. But yeah. First pass, 200 millimeters per second. Made it all the way through. Anyway, one inch down. On the Atom Stack S20. laser engraver you guys take care this is the x-tool rotary too by the way um, I've got the atom stack rotary which I use if I need to set something on rollers but the x-tool if I need a chuck the x-tool is the way to go for that anyway you guys take care we'll see you in the next one